Hello everybody, AJ Rysik here, and today we are taking a look at how to install a vanilla GNOME session on Ubuntu 18.04. Now, so why are we doing this? You know, if you are, if you're somebody that has come from, say, Ubuntu GNOME 16.04, you had pretty much a vanilla GNOME experience. Um, same thing if you're coming from some other di distributions they don't that they stick with a fairly stock gnome experience and for a lot of you that's probably what you want personally that is what i'm looking for for um and you know in in ubuntu 1804 they have tried to i think ease the transition for people coming from the unity desktop or people that are coming over from windows say um and while I can understand that, for me personally, I want more of a GNOME experience. So we're gonna we're gonna install that on our on our system right now. It's not hard to do. Basically, about three lines that we're gonna put into the terminal. I'll leave down in the video description. I'll leave the lines that you need to add in. There's also gonna be a uh, a follow up post on my blog, so you can go and check that out if you want to. Um, but let's stop talking about it. We'll get to it and, and uh, get this show rolling. So everything that we're going to do here, we can do in the terminal. So let's open up a terminal. And the first thing we're going to do is we got a few things that we are going to remove. And we'll put in a line of code that says sudo snap remove gnome 326-1604, gnome calculator, no characters, gnome logs, gnome system monitor. And don't worry, I will have instructions down below on uh, you know all of the lines of code that we're going to put in here. So you'll put that in, you'll be asked for your password, and then boom, it starts removing all that stuff for you. So the next thing we're going to add in is sudo apt install gnome session. And that's going to install our uh, vanilla gnome session. So it shows you zero upgraded, three newly installed. And we're going to click on yes to install that. Let it do its thing. And it'll take it a little bit to go and install that. Oh, there, there we go. Okay, so now we are going to reboot. And I'll show you how to log into that vanilla GNOME session. Okay, so here we are at our login screen. So click on the little gear icon right next to where it says sign in and you'll see where it says GNOME on XOR. You want to select that, go ahead and put in your password and this will log us into that default GNOME session. Or vanilla GNOME, whatever you want to call it. Let's open up the terminal and uh, I'll make it a little bigger so it's a little easier for you to see. So we got one line that we've got to copy and paste in there. It is sudo apt install vanilla gnome desktop and vanilla gnome default settings. Once again, I'll ask this for a password. Boom. Uh, yes and just give it some time to go and download and install all that okay that's all complete so what we're going to do is we will close out the terminal and we will reboot again so you can already see a change we are using the Ubuntu GNOME login screen here so let's just go and you can see once again GNOME on XORG. Put in our password so we can log in. And you can see that yes, we do have the uh, we still have the Ubuntu welcome screen. Let me close that out. But what we've got here is pretty much vanilla GNOME. Uh, no extensions running. Um, you know, a default wallpaper, all that good stuff.
Well, I hope you found this useful. As always, leave comments, questions, all that kind of stuff down below. I'll try to get to it as soon as possible. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Just click that little subscribe button down there. And then when that little bell icon shows up, if you click on that, you'll be able to get notifications every time I post a video so you can stay up to date with all my uh, most recent videos. Uh, please share this with friends, family, social media, all that kind of stuff. And I hope to see you all on my next video. Thanks a lot.